I'm like, you know, fucked out. It's uh, it's the firmament. You can't get past that firmament. Yeah, man. The, they call it the Alan, Alan something Iron Belt or whatever. They said that the belt you can't get past it because it's full of radiation. Stones also. Right. They showing you that they lying to you that they went to the moon, man. But you know what the thing is? People are so stupid. They can actually now sell you. We have bio, uh, uh, bio on the uh, biological on the uh, vegetables, and we have organic vegetables. You should be thinking in your head like, wait a minute. So they stupefy people so much that they even they're not even in uproars because of biological food and organic food. That don't make no fucking sense. All food is supposed to be biological, and all food is supposed to be organic. And you know I have no hatred towards that shit. If there was a Jake female, I would have a fucking problem with that little whore ass clothing what they got. But since it's not no my pants. people, I don't actually give a fuck. He got no pants on. No pants. Bitch, you got a hot pants on. It's fucking cold, and it's raining outside. I have no problem whatsoever with it. That's how you get raped quick. I'm not even raped. thinking about that. I'm thinking like, what, what does it make me angry? I don't feel nothing. You know what I'm saying? That's why you Jake females that want to dress like either my females, cool cat man, go ahead, do your thing, man. I'm a heavenly father willing. Your father's gonna be avenged. And I'm not talking about your father that you have right now. That's okay, you can't, can't even fucking teach you how to dress. I'm talking about your ancestors, your forefathers. Because if they was to see you right now, you'd be put to death, 100%. Because it says that the priest, if his daughter is a hope, Burn that bitch with fire and stone her with stones that she died. And I know some of y'all forefathers is a Levite. We'd be put to death just for that. And then now, actually, all of us have the position of a king and a priest. So guess what? All of y'all are in the line of death. In the line of death, lined up. Because all of y'all are daughters of priests and kings. So all y'all are li li liable get yourself killed by your dress code. You're not supposed to dress like that. You know what I'm saying? Even this is respectable. Respectable clothing. But the, guess what that is? That's that's another Arab woman. They, at least she, she dressed respectable. She has a dress on. You don't see her or, or her legs. Nothing. That's how our, our Jacob uh, descendant women are supposed to clothe themselves. But our women are dressing like a bunch of hoes and they think that shit's cute. Once that time comes, when we have our power, you're going to die. And then I want you to run to the white boy. He's going to try to save you. Then the Heavenly Father is going to put the spirit on him, on us, on him to kill you too. Or let him break so they can both get burned. Oh, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter, man. Because once that war comes, once that war comes, over here you're going to die. Over there you're going to die. In the middle is, is, is beasts. You're going to die by them too. Because the Mosai is going to send them animals to come fuck your ass up. Just like how he did back in the days when he sent them hornets on them giants. It was giants that was running from hornets. And then one of those little itty bitty baby hornets, man. It's like the there was some big ass, fucking ass, horny ass motherfuckers. The you hear him flying too. Dumb. You <laughs> think it was a fucking helicopter? What the fuck is it? That hours. shit stab you, you blow up right there. That's how fat you get, man. That shit will make you fat. You know what I'm saying? Everybody that's skinny, go dance with some hornets. Like See Japanese what's gonna happen. Hornets. Size of chihuahuas. Yeah, 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 like that one. They, they even shoot poison in your fucking face. Yeah, man. The big hornets, when you come to the nest, they'll fly around in your face and shoot poison right in your eyes. Yeah, man. You got ants, you got ants that shoot acid. Yeah. And they stab. The bullet ant is worse than the hornet's sting. Yeah, man. You know what I'm saying? No, and to you can imagine an ant that's this big. And he bites you. That you, you, you might die from pain, man. What is it? The that little itty bitty tiny little motherfucker. He already hurt you. Hey, it's tiny. Can you imagine if that ant was this big? His head was oh, this man. big. He'd be dead. Yeah. And he'd he probably he snap you? your ass in too. But when he bites you, he'd be dead. He'd, you'd be losing a lot of pain. Like He'll grab you right in your admin and he'll start stabbing you with a stinger. Hey, my man, you'd be dead, you'd be dead. An uh, ant as big as this, you'd be dead, man. And I think like you'd three be dead. Four, five, ten, twenty. Yeah, and they're on a million, dude. They're, 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 on, them, they're, they're on a couple of million, dude. They're chopping and they're going, they're going, man, don't put them on. They'll carry they're you off in pieces. One of my favorite animals, man. Yo, man. See his face? 
Back in the days, I always wanted to be as strong as an ant. You check, you check the, the yeah, face yeah. of an ant, closed, closed up. Right. You look, look, uh, you look uh, tough, man. You look, you look real tough. So you called look real tough, too. They got the yeah, ones man. where they have the, the pinches that snap so hard and fast. And then they, then they showed uh, uh, ancient ones, too. They look yeah. similar to those. Yeah. They look bigger, but like, it looks look strange, the man. They got like a lot of babies over here, man, because they're allowed. They got three. Four even, four. Hey, they can't do that shit in their own country, man. Yeah, they be good But you know what's in Pakistan? <laughs> they have a lot of children, but they, they're starving over there. And they they keep making children. more babies. Yeah. Yeah. But, that, but actually, you should be thinking about it like they should be blessed into it. Because yeah. our people are stupid too. Our people are living in tropical countries. Look at Venezuela. How the fuck is Venezuela suffering? Was, how the fuck was Venezuela suffering from food? Very you can literally, way. literally, just look around, see nothing but forest area, right? Forest area. All you need to do is grab a seat, go somewhere, plant it, come back all the time watering. From that tree that's going to sprout up, it's going to have babies. Well, not babies, I mean. It's going to have fruit. <laughs> and the fruit is going to have seeds. And then from that one fruit, from one tree, you can plant now 15 trees. And from that 15 trees, you got like a bunch of fucking hundred something. And then, you know, you know, and this is just one man. How about, how about if you, if you get together and make agreement with each other, like how to farm the land? The Heavenly Father took that from us, man. That's in the book of Isaiah chapter 3, verse 1 on there. He took it from us. Yeah. The, 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 the capability the to think of uh, being self-sufficient. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we, we're not thinking like that. Yeah, Our yeah. people are thinking of buying shit. Yeah. They're not thinking of planting stuff. That programming is my mother, my mother always said like this. It's big as shit this and this. She says like these black people, they're lazy, they're stupid. They're supposed to plant. They're supposed to do this, do that. Here in this cold ass weather, my mother is still planting. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? The programming is heavy, man. You, you can't believe it. I, me, me, myself, even. When I was uh, in Holland, I wasn't thinking about getting a job uh, to make money and uh, developing myself because that's more important than going to school. I was thinking about, no, school is good. You know, to get a diploma so that you can get more money. Right. The programming is heavy, man. It's fucked up. It took, it took some time to break through through the, uh, to, to see it for yourself, to, to, to have that, uh, how do you say that? Uh, um, it, it, it was hard to basically uh, uh, to deprogram that out of my mind, man, for some reason. It's witchcraft, man. Yeah, man, it's witchcraft. It's heavy. That's why you shouldn't be letting your children in the midst of Esau in the schools and thinking like, okay, 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 that's okay. Yeah, he suffered a lot. Where's your father, man? Not in the house, probably. Man. Your mother. Your mother probably mother fought allows you. That. Mother allows that, man. But then, uh, who's reading you? Uh, this one is just something we know. I'm sorry, Ezekiel 35. Uh, go, let's finish the Hebrew. Oh, yeah. This is uh, until when? Until uh, the fat game. Okay. There be anything on the game. Yeah. This is Hebrews chapter 12. Verse 12, uh, verse, let me start at 11. Now, no chastening for the present seemeth to be joyous, but grievous. Nevertheless, afterward, it yielded the feasible fruit of righteousness. That's what we pray <laughs> that we get, the feasible fruit of righteousness. Unto them which are exercised thereby. Yep, just like how you hit the gym. We need to be exercised in the chastisement of the Lord so that he can actually provide us with the reward thereof, you know? Because you're not, you're, not, you're not going to, listen, anybody that runs a marathon, right, you'll be looking at them like, what the fuck are you wasting your time for? Actually, it's an achievement. What's the achievement? I, I, I achieve something. It's a personal thing. But with the Heavenly Father, it's beyond personal. It's his personal thing for you. And it's going to benefit you. What are you going to get in this kingdom when you win a marathon? A medal. 
Yeah. And you gonna bite it like it's fucking real quick? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everybody dick been up in that motherfucking thing because they touch that shit, man. Yeah, yeah. And I, I know they've been to the toilet. <laughs> you know, somebody gonna give you a medal, right? And then the first thing you gonna do is put it in your mouth. Put it in your mouth. Check this shit out. You have to understand somebody touched it before you. Probably went to the toilet. You know how these devils are. They ain't washing their hands shit, man. You don't want to take a shit. Don't even wipe your ass. You just get off the toilet. Right up. Yeah. That's Come. what's happening with you. Right? Yeah. So, <laughs> yes, man. So, I seen that happen with my own eyes. Right. So, hey, man. It ain't nothing, man. It ain't nothing. <laughs> you get a medal up in this world. So fucking what, man? So what? Once you get that medal from your Basha Mi it's, it's, it's not going to be a medal around your neck. It's going to be a medal around your head. And that medal is going to be a gold. Yes, gold is a medal too. I'm not talking about iron. I'm talking about gold. You're going to get a golden crown on your head. Or a, silver, a real medal. Yeah. Or a silver crown. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because some of the brothers are going to be polished onto gold. And some of the brothers are going to be polished onto silver. And some of the other brothers are going to be polished on the gemstones. I'm about to have both. All three of them. That'd be dope, man. Not everybody's going to get a high status, so you better get used to it right now in your head. Check this out. <laughs> <laughs> better get used to it. <laughs> but why is King David's crown more better than mine? <laughs> Holy shit. Hello. Watch your house. Nah, I ain't even going to say that. As you see, these, these modern Muslims, they, they, they wear uh, skin tight too now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah. see that? Yeah. The hijab is good, but the skin tight thing is right, right there. The right, Ramadan right, right. is over, that's why. And yeah, he's just walking around like, whoa. Modern day. This modern guy's day. a Simpson. Just like that modern guy that was complaining, remember? There's videos about shit like this. Yeah, man. He was complaining how these. I sent you some of the, him, his videos yeah, yeah, yeah. also about the yeah. Muslim guy. Yeah, yeah. But he, saw, he, only saw. Use, he doesn't only use the, the, saw, the but Muslim. He, but he hates, uh, uh, he hates Muslims now. Yeah. He, he turned from that. He said it brainwashed them. He was, he was for first very racist against white people. That's the, 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 you love white people, right? You run away from your own God. But anyway, he was racist <laughs> against white people in the beginning because he thought he was better than them. Because that's what his parents is told him, telling them, teaching them. And then he started to mingle more around them. And then he started to get to know them. And then he, he actually threw the, the, the Quran on the side. But that's what happens to you when you're around Which Edomites. Was, the guy that you, you showed me. Oh, no, YouTube. no, he's a Muslim. Eh? Oh, wait a minute. Then this other, no, no, no. This, oh, sorry. Right. No, no, no. This other one. Uh, the other one was, uh, he was, yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Okay, no, no, no. I'm, I'm mixed them up. This is the other one that was, uh, he was looking kind of young. And uh, he was saying, yeah, I, I, I don't know what he was saying. He was saying that uh, now, uh, the fee, the way he has, uh, the people have more trouble getting girls because the girls are westernized now. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. that guy, yeah. that guy, yeah, yeah. I thought you was talking about the other one. Let's switch one. Because the one that you sent me, I I went to check out his page and he said, yo, oh, no, it's not good anymore. No uh, Islam thing following, it's not good. That's what he said. But did that guy? Yeah, yeah. It's not, it's not, uh, so yeah, that's, that's what happens, you know. But the thing is, he's an Ishmaelite, right? Yeah. yeah. But the funny thing is, stickers, stickers. Oh, then he's a, he's a, he's probably most likely a damn leader mine anyways. He he's stickers. He just looks like a Ishmaelite. Yeah, he looks kind of Arabish, he like. But, but when you look at his face, you stare at him, and then and then he when he tells you, you be like, oh yeah, you do look like a Turk. But he doesn't have the flat head like a Turk. A Turk Turks have a flat head in the back most of the time, a lot of times. But if they don't have it, then sometimes they look like Arabs. I saw this Turkish dude that I used to work with. He looks like a damn Amalekite, straight up Amalekite. Yeah, yeah, they look like each other. More north and shit, you know? Right, right. right. And uh, I, I thought he was a damn Amalekite, but then he told me he's a Turkish, so I was like, oh, you are. You are. Let's finish up uh, the last uh, until 15. This is uh, <coughs> verse 12. Wherefore, lift up the hands which hang down. Right. And the feeble knees lift up the hands which hang down. That's where they get the saying from. Why are you dragging your you dragging your knuckles? You ain't doing shit. You, or, or you at the job with your hands in your pockets. People gonna be looking at you like get your fucking hands out your pockets. So smooth working. But this is when when when, when Jacob is torn broken and, and, and all messed up. Because that's our people. And make straight paths for your feet. Lest that witch's name be turned out of the way, but let it rather be healed. Let it rather be healed. That's what's going to happen to us. And first and foremost, 
We're being healed with this word right now. You know what I'm saying? Comfort ye one another with these words. Yeah. Go on. Follow peace with all men and holiness, without without which no man shall see the Lord. For, uh, to a certain degree. Because you can't be at peace with a man that's not at peace with you. But if it's normally, if, it, if it's possible, you'd be at peace with all men. Heavenly Father said that. Yeah, exactly. Right? Looking diligently, lest any man fail of the grace of the Most High. Lest any man fail of the grace of the Heavenly Father. And, who, and, and what's the grace of the Most High? Yahweh Shai. Because he's the Spirit of Grace. So if you fail in that, you already know what type of death is going to be waiting. Lest any root of bitterness springing up trouble you. And who's bitter right now? Start the Jacob descendants. Why? Because you're going through some things and now you're finna be bitter. Because this is the time that you're going to see a lot of people actually love us of themselves, doing all fancy type of things, getting all crazy type of money and stuff like that. And you might be thinking like, maybe I should join first school. No, no, no. That's some satanic stuff, man. We don't do stuff like that. We don't believe in bunnies that lay eggs. We don't believe in flying reindeers and bullshit like that. This is not in the scriptures. Because what they're doing is, is heavy satanic. They're going back to some Eastern bunny, Esther, Easter shit. That's what they're doing, man. But the Heavenly Father said, don't be following that for them. Don't be like, oh, I'm, I'm alone. You know, this how unholy day. I feel so bad. Fuck that. You're supposed to be a man. You're supposed to be like, fuck this shit. I don't need this. Just do your daily things, daily prayer, set up what the Heavenly Father told you to set up. We eat lamb on the Pasha. Right? The Passover is not a day to celebrate or find bunnies that lay eggs and shit like that. The Passover is a day where you rememorate the, the, the killings of the enemies that enslaved our people for 400 years. And not those people in Israel, those are not the real Israelites. These are the real Israelites, what the Bible speaks of. The so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Indianos. Those are the Israelites of the Bible. Those people that are in Israeli right now, they're not the Israelites. Because the scripture says that you're supposed to eat lamb roasted with fire. What do they eat in Israel? They eat egg, they eat chicken, and, and, and uh, all type of other type of things and stuff like that. Kosher pig. The, the Bible says you can't do that. But they don't believe in the Bible. They got the Kabbalah. What's it yeah, uh, The Talmud. The Talmud. And they believe in the uh, Kabbalah, Kabbalah, Kabbalah or something like that. Which is some satanic shit. Because I saw a few things that was written therein. It says you can have sex with children. According to their book. That's why when they circumcise themselves, they actually put their mouth on the penis of the little boy. That's a good point. Where's that in the Bible? The Bible says thou shalt not eat blood, nor drink blood, nor have it in your mouth. What do they do? They're doing against the Bible. So who are the two people of the Bible? The ones that follow the scriptures. Which are the so-called Nicholas Latinos and the others. And nobody else. No. Verse 15. <coughs> Looking diligently, lest any man fail of the grace of the Most High, right. lest any root of bitterness springing up trouble you, and thereby many be defiled. And thereby many be defiled, because what is going to defile you is that bitterness up in your soul, that anger. You get offended. Like, for example, when the Lord said, don't eat pork, and you still do it, you're bitter. You're yeah. sad. Why doesn't why does, why does it say that I can eat pork? I'm going to eat pork. I'm going to eat pork. Now you're going to get angry. Well, he's not my God then. Leaning That's that bitterness. You're leaning up on your own understanding. Yeah. And you're not supposed to be doing these type of things. Yeah. Right? That's it. Yeah, man. So that's it. So with that, we're going to give all praises to the Most High Yahweh. Ba'ashem Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem Kapadash. Double honor, son, to the elder apostles at Great Millstone for the teachings of the scriptures, among other things. And shalom to the sincere Akim across the world. Shalom, shalom, shalom.